Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I go by the name of Yolo Kazikagi, but you guys can most definitely call me Yolo. Now this is a video update on Simpiwe Mdimande who staged her entire hijacking. Now she took to her Facebook account that she had just been hijacked and that her hijackers put her in the boot of her car. She further went on to state that they took her phone not knowing that that was not the only phone that she owns now she kept on updating us on her facebook account with this second phone which you know the hijackers did not see she even went as far as saying that the car has stopped and now they are fighting on who is going to have sex with her now a whole lot of people went on panic mode and, and now this is when the hashtag find simpy was started many big celebrities even you know um joined in the hashtag find some now amongst those people was a guy named chris Mbedu who works at a trafficking company in joburg and he says that when they received a call about a girl who was kidnapped they asked for all her details such as recent location car registration and contact details etc he stated that the time was 11 30 p.m but because he had gone through the girl's timeline and saw what he saw he got really scared and decided to call one of his colleagues who works with him to try and help the girl he further went on to say that they use their own money for fuel a time and after they searched with no luck they then asked a big company with larger resources for assistance to see if they can locate her and to their surprise the car was at her home location um, a police friend to Chris further revealed that um, she, Simpiwe, drove herself to the police station. There were no stretches on the car, nor did Simpiwe have any stretches as she stated on her Facebook account. Now, it is believed that she did all of that prank of hers on the entire country in order to receive attention from her boyfriend and that, you know, she did not think that that post will receive as much as attention as it did and um of course the family is also protecting her so we don't really know the real reason as to why she would prank the entire country now mavela Mas masondo who's the spokes person captain said that simpiwe has been charged with perjury fraud and defeating the ends of justice for opening a false hijacking case at the police station she later allegedly confessed to police that she was never hijacked nor kidnapped now that is it from me you guys thank you so much for joining me please don't forget to share like and comment and engage with me down on the comment section I will definitely see you guys on my next upload. Bye.